I'm Nancy Power and I am a garden designer and I'm based in Santa Monica, California. My work is totally uh, emotional, uh, intuitive, but I'm interested most in the sensuality in the garden. It's no accident that, that the garden is paradise in every religion. I think I built my first garden when I was about seven. And, uh, I don't suffer from nature deficit disorder. I get cabin fever inside and want to get outside. And I think it was Socrates who made sure that his classrooms were always outside because he said people learn better outside. I don't have one style, I adapt to the situation. And I've been very fortunate to have an extremely diverse set of clients from tiny little pocket backyards to vast estates to public spaces. I work with my staff in a very collaborative way. Um, the roles are not well defined because everybody gets to do a little bit of everything. Most of my work is in California, and I find every, that transition space between the indoors and the outdoors is a magical place. And I focus my work on that transition. And so that porch, the veranda, call it whatever you want to, the terrace, the patio, it has a great tradition in America. The colors and the textures and materials for the garden are dictated by the site. I have the advantage and disadvantages of figuring out sites very quickly and what could be done. I automatically see how things relate and I almost always come back to what the core impression was. And from there, then we go into the detail and the specifics of what the, the site needs to be. You define space through light in the garden. So I'm always thinking about the way I feel physically in a space as well as emotionally. They're really closely linked here. It's a whole experience. Frank Gehry and I are the same way. I work with Frank all the time, and we both come to it from a sensual, passionate point of view as opposed to a dry, theoretical point of view. I'm asked, is your work innovative? And I go, no, it's just perfectly natural and, and intuitive and it's what it should be. Garden design is not a fashion statement. It's not a trend. It's not a gimmick. It's not a brand. It's far deeper than that. I feel very blessed that I'm where I am today and I just want to keep planting trees and making people happy. That's my mission. <laughs>